trouble, you make me responsible for getting us out. As in Maribor. Remember Maribor? Dove, please don't change the subject. Mind if I do? That depends. Who might you be? Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. You Eveline Gallo? The Ermine? Only to friends. Calm down, Merrin. No need to puff up. And you? Talk. What do you want? Got a job for you. Truly? Of what nature? Hmm. Anonymous performance. No audience. At a certain auction house. Pays as much as you can carry. Eveline, I beg you. You don't know him. What's that supposed to mean? He introduced himself. Did you not hear? Geralt of Rivia. Stop pretending you don't understand me. You cannot know if he's to be trusted. Not a soul can be trusted. Hmm. You've none of a Fink's features. But you see, I've a problem. All right, out with it. What's this problem? See, we were to do a show. The tickets have all sold. Alas, our friend and colleague, Hawkeye Van, well, he's gone blind. Drank some hooch from a questionable source. A sad story, but not the point. The crowd awaits, so either we find a replacement for him, or we shall have to return the coin. All good and fine, but we're not spent it already. Ah, I think I know where this is going. And I shall get straight to the point. Stand in for Van, and I shall help you. What do I have to do? Jump through some flaming hoops? No. Shoot your crossbow, hit a target. Eveline, I'm not certain that's a good idea. Neither am I. It shall all come out in the wash. So, Witcher, what'll it be? Not a bad shot with my crossbow. Why not? I'm in. Splendid. So, shall we begin? Folk have grown nervous. What? Mean now? No rehearsals? What's that to rehearse? You're to shoot and hit a target. Hit it square on. All right. Do or die. Let's begin. That I like. A man who boldly dares damn the risks. Come! And now, good folk, the highlight of our program. Standing before you, Geralt of Rivia, victor of markmanship contest in Angren, Dol Blathana, and Lobinden. What? But I... Shh! Geralt! Grab your crossbow and get to work! What's the hell? Shoot! feet by Geralt of Rivia. We thank you for attending and hope to see you soon. It's a shame that man didn't shoot the elf. That would have been brilliant. You know, I doubted I'd emerge from that ordeal in one piece. Fine work, Geralt. Well, one performance down. What of the next? Herbalist has a hut near here. Ring a bell? Go see him and ask for some yarrow extract. Ooh, a mystery. I adore mysteries. Till later, Witcher.
Greetings again. So, you got a job for me, an interesting one. Show me what you have in stock. side of the Ponta. What do you have to say? Lance Corporal Vatslav. How'd that prick wind up with us? Volunteered. Word is he had to bribe the medics to let him enlist. Are he mad or what? That's just it. Certifiably insane. Didn't pass the tests apparently. But to pay hard coin to enter the army. Thought at my age nothing could surprise me. Nothing about the cook. The night what do you have to say? Did he have a white hair or a white horse? You got a daughter? Why do you ask? Well, think on it. To marry into a dynasty like that, it'd be like living in Clover. Trust me. You do better not to take any interest in the Basordis. Why the hell not? It can only bring trouble, mate. Only trouble. Hmm. Nothing interesting. What do you have to say? Fish chowder for supper of the day. That true? Who told you? No one. Came through the western gate the morning. Saw Martin on the pier, rod in hand, fishing. Cook like that's the right treasure he is. No griping about poor supplies. Just the gumption to him. Uh, aye. If only he'd go a bit lighter on the garlic. Pier near the western gate. Should be easy enough to find. Oh! Ooh. Watch your step. 
Redania. Good day, fish biting. Aye, they're biting. What about you? What's that? Got this mixture. Pay you to pour it in the soup for the boys at the garrison, on my signal. Nothing dangerous about it. Most they'll think is that the fish wasn't exactly fresh. It'll cost you, mate. Something dear. Asking a lot, too much. How about you do this free of charge, huh? Out of the kindness of your heart. Aye, I'll help. Out of kindness. Wait for the signal, and mum's the word, understood? And Countess Yvonne of Lanexeter's necklace. Your handiwork, wasn't it? It was. I scaled a gutter, entered her bedchamber. Ha! <laughs> I knew it, I knew it. Ah, at last, we're all here. Time to begin. This heist is no jest. So if any of you has any doubts, isn't sure, now's the time to leave. Won't be able to after. Or so does auction house, it's vault. That's our target. Everline, you'll enter through the tower when the patrol rounds this corner. Drop us a line. We have to be inside within five minutes, as I know. It's plenty. Splendid. Once we're all in the tower, we'll proceed to the auction house. Shouldn't see any guards inside. If we do, we'll have Gallant and his blades. Then, downstairs to the vault. Quinto will crack the lock. We get in the vault, take the loot, disappear out the back through a secret passage. I've said my piece. Any questions? All right, let's get to work. I want to be done with this as soon as possible. We'll reconvene in the gateway beside the tower. Midnight sharp. And everyone's to make sure they're not followed. I'll get word to the cook in the barracks. What about wearing masks? Not a city in the north that don't have wanted posters with my likeness hanging about. I'll tend to that. Ah, one last thing. 
Inform the City Watch. Blabber anything about this over and out. And I'll kill you. With me own hands. If you're so damn scared somebody will talk, let's all go there together. Now. Any objections? Anyone need more time? On our way, then. Let's begin. Prime. Just one patrol. Mixture of yours must have worked. Eveline, you ready? Are you kidding? Of course I am. Three, two, one. City foul, shite all over again. What? Not so. Trot's turning round. We've one minute. Move. Serves. You assured us there be no one inside. Seems my informer was wrong. Is that all you've got to say? I nearly broke my neck. You knew what you were signing up for. This is no time to argue. Gotta agree. Backing out's not an option anymore. Need to see this through, whatever happens. Hallowed words. One guard could mean many more. You'd best draw your sword now. No. What now? No one dies. Said so from the start. Whatever. Don your masks and let's go. Letters must be old. String seems to say so too. It 
was true love. Clear for now. Knock on wood. Good. I in the back here, Eds, everyone. Mine are open. I've already seen several things I'd gladly take with me. Yes, but we shall raise the starting pr Watch this! Guards! Guards! I should have stayed in that cage. You said! I damn well know what I said! At them before they sound the alarm! Locked themselves in. Bollocks! Damn it. Lay down your arms! You have no chance! Perhaps not. <laughs> but we do have hostages. Mercy, Master! On the count of three, we go in! One! Two! <laughs> Come one step closer and folk will die! Hold now! We must negotiate. What are your demands? To release the hostages? Buy us a bit of time, Geralt. Not about to hide behind these folk. I'm letting them go. Are you mad? Any idea what'll happen? Yes. And do you have any idea what'll happen if you try to stop me? Out of my way. Now. An honorable deed! The court's sure to consider it a mitigating factor. Now, you've one minute to come out. One at a time. Hands on your heads! I'm going. Up the chimney and out. It's grown too hot, pure and simple. Best of luck, gentlemen. Drink to our health, once you're far away. You had your chance! Attack! Still insist on using that wooden sword. Get to work, Quinto. We'll try and hold off the assault. Meantime, the vault awaits. Ought to be open by now.
the lock. Lovingly crafted. Two spring-loaded bolts, cylindrical plugs, Dameritian wards. I'm not interested. No one's interested. We go in. Geralt, you're at the fore. Why me? It's why I hired you. Now move. We've no time. Mm -hmm. Do or die. You don't know who you're fucking with! On the contrary, I know all too well. Yeah, you old? Greetings, brother. Been years. Well, well. Complications, complications. You owe us an explanation, you old Borsodi. This family reunion. What's the point? Revenge. For betrayal. Years of poverty. Humiliation. Father left the auction house to me in his will. Horst cheated me. Had me disinherited. Anything. Everything we earned, you squandered on cards and whores. Father didn't see that. I did. That's no excuse, Horst. Save your life. You two, stand with me. I'll not let the Redanians lay a hand on you. Give you whatever you want. Not about to meddle, especially not in family matters. Then you'd have done better not to break into my vault. I fear it's too late to turn neutral. Stand with me, and I shall drape you in gold. Stand against me. And you'll remain here forever. If that's your attitude, I'll stand with you, old. Speak for yourself. Tempting offer. I've succumbed. You'll pay for that, Quinto. With your head. At them!
I'd have preferred to resolve this elsewise. Stolen the scrolls, thrown you out into the street. Revenge is best served cold, after all. But I don't mind serving it hot. No. I beg you. Mercy. For your brother. I shall do anything you ask. Truly. Anything. Anything. Sign over to me. All that you own. Then walk out as you stand with just the clothing on your back. Allow me one thing. Any one thing. Fifteen years. In the sewers. Bang. Like a beast. And you the cheek. To plead. Satisfied? Exceptionally. You? No, and I won't be until I find Max Brasotti's house. In this vault, or so you said. And it is. There. But I fear it's not yours for the taking. You see, it houses my father's will. A scroll thanks to which Ewald Borsodi, long missing, will assume the family. Fortune. And Geralt of Rivia, who you cheated, what'll he assume? Alas, but he's free to choose anything else. You tricked me. And you were prepared to let me face Horst's thugs alone. To my mind, we're even. Now, Max Borsodi's house. If you've absolutely got to have it, you'll need to take it from me by force. Hmm. Dumb. But have it your way. Let's make this quick before the soldiers get down here. At your service, mate.
damn candles. The Danians will be here soon. Damn it, the secret passage, where is it? Long live Chat. I'm all ears with you. Got something for you. I love gifts, but I prefer to unwrap them in private. Oi, right, lads, mind the barrels. Going out for a jabber with Geralt. Come. Cool. Oh, that's better. All right. What do you have for me? Max Persodi's house, as requested. Ah, Horst must be livid. He's not. No. He's not anything except dead. His brother, same thing. A few others, too. Stones you've got. But I didn't think you'd have a stomach for a massive situation got out of hand. <laughs> oh, sounds familiar. There you are, drinking, puffing on henbane. 
And then, surprise, heads rolling across the floor. I don't know how or why. I'm not amused. No. Why not? Because unlike you, killing gives me no pleasure. The boss orders aren't worth your tears. Sons of bitches to a man. The Borsodis, what's your gripe? Get kicked out of an auction? Worse. They evicted me from a home. Are you really interested? Wouldn't have asked if I wasn't. Ha! <laughs> Cheeky as ever. My family. They took on some debt. A poor investment in a sawmill. A bad crop on you. A lawsuit lost. You know how it is. When it rains, it pours. We needed but a few weeks to recover. But Horst Borsodi had acquired our debt. All of it. Demanded it be repaid immediately. I pleaded. I begged. I tore open my shirt at his threshold. Ugh. It was like talking to a wall. I went to the auction. Saw those perfumed pricks by my father's sword. My mother's death mask. My brother's horse tack. Ah, Horst earned a pretty pile selling our mementos. No surprise the animosity you feel for him. That was but the start. My Iris's parents learned of my family's misfortune. And our betrothal was no more. They found her another suit. One from beyond the sea. The anger I felt. I thought I'd gone mad. Went to the tavern. Drank around. A second. I brawled. Then had another tank. And then... Then... I asked the wrong bloke for help. What happened then? Ah, what happened then, Witcher, was one big stinking pile of shite. Why do you stand there? Do you need something still? Third wish. Time you stated it. A moment, Geralt. I will say to something. Then we'll chat. You there. Yank the herring out the barrel. this dallying. Now, ready to listen? Or do you still not give two shots about what I've got to say? I'm ready. I'm listening. Good. You'll return to your lord and tell him as follows. His demand was brazen. Hurt me to the core. For I was brought up to respect the sacred law of hospitality. And I shall not bend to an uncouth boar's dictum. Understood. I will pay him a visit shortly to test his willingness to adapt. So you ride off and announce me. And don't spare your horse. Got it? Aye, got it. Give this man a mount and leave him go. Come with you. We must talk outside. The theory believe one should only discuss important matters out of doors, with the gods as witnesses. Fulfilled two of your wishes. Time I learned the third. Confident, aren't you? Proud, sure of your strengths. Fearless. Third task, if you don't mind. Mutations. They stripped you of emotion. Tell me, have you ever loved? I mean, truly loved. You don't give a shit, old Geard. You'd make piss poor company for a talk about love anyway. Third wish, still waiting to hear it. Aye, aren't you stubborn? Fine. 
Listen well. I had a wife once. The day I saw her last, I gave her a rose. A violet one. Bring me that blue. Wouldn't mind reminding myself what it looks like. <sighs> when was that? How long's it been? Flowers wilted and turned to dust by now. You wished to hear a wish. Now you out. Fulfill it. I ride now to visit this Dauntless, but one of my men will remain here. He'll know how to find me. That is, of course, should you succeed. At least you could tell me where your wife is. In my old manor, east of Martin Foy's farmstead. I'd wish you Godspeed, but, well, you understand, I'm sure. Goodbye, Geralt. Anyone there? 